This device is actually going to hold a chicken. Uh, you can pick this up at Lowe's, uh, some home departments. You can order it online if you need be. Anyway, Enrico took a couple pair of these back to Germany with him because they were kind of a unique. And I sure I'll show a short clip here in a second on the stuff I used to make a brine. But anyway, here goes. <sighs> Another thing I do is to help smoke the meat that I'm, that I'm making is I use hickory chunks. I don't like mesquites, it's too much. A good chunk or two of hickory and you'll be alright. But mom gave me, oh she bought me chips. So what I did is I just soaked them, put them in this bag, fold the bag up. Turn it over so that the smoke escape perforated with little holes. It's ready to go. Okay, I got the I got the bird on. Got it breast facing the briquettes. Oh, you got to watch it now. After about 45 minutes, 50 minutes, come out and check it, and I may turn it around, because I don't want that front side to get too, too dark. Um, we're looking at a temperature maybe about 325, 350. We'll see how it goes from there. Okay, it's been close to I think this needs to be turned. And I may have to replenish the charcoal. Okay, obviously there's no more chicken left. By the time I came out to temp it, I was losing light. And um, I just wanted to get it back in the house. It temped out at 165, which is perfect. Um, it worked out nicely. You see, I didn't use beer. I used something different. Uh, you could probably use anything you want. You juice broth whatever I don't suggest using wine because the tannins may leach from the liquid into the bird uh, unfortunately I had to cut it short like I said just losing light but you can take a look at my smoking turkey video and it'll give you more or less an idea how to finish up anyway I'll put a bit you